Righteous Georgians. Don't worry, the dentist will be with you shortly. Oh, I hope so. Is Mr. Ian good? Mr. Ian? Yeah, on the sign outside. Mr. George Ian. Oh, no. He's Mr. Georgian. He's one of the most modern doctors here at the Historical Dentist. You're in safe ish hands. Ish? Ah, oh, good day to you. Now, I understand that you are suffering from some rather serious dental pain. Well, not to worry. We Georgian dentists are very advanced in this area. False teeth, fillings, the ill effects of too much sugar, all these things are known to us. That's very reassuring. As is the use of sticks, we and gunpowder, in cleaning teeth. What? Mm, odd. Right, open up if you wouldn't mind. Mmm, now there is some rather serious decay there. I don't see why I shouldn't just scrape away the decaying area and put a filling in it. Well, that sounds okay. Would you like me to heat up the wire, Doctor? It takes a while to get it red hot. What's the red hot wire for? Well, we touch your nerve ending with the red hot wire to cauterize it. Now, what sort of filling would you like? Lead or beeswax? Well, neither. Lead's poisonous and beeswax will just melt. Well, I could do your porcelain one, but, uh, well, the solution we use in that process kills the tooth, so you'd end up with a white filling and a black tooth. No! <laughs> and frankly, I don't want a red hot wire in my mouth anyway. Ah, ah yes. Ah. Now, you do seem to be in a lot of pain. I don't see why I shouldn't just remove the whole tooth. Well, will that hurt? Not unless I take half your jaw with it. What? Now, don't worry. That sort of thing only happens when a Georgian barber does your dental work. I, on the other hand, am a professional operator to the teeth. That's what the Georgians used to call dentists. It's very grand. <laughs> we shall just remove the bad tooth and replace it with a false one. Bit on the large side, isn't it? <laughs> I see. Well, I'm not going to hurt and then hurt, 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 hurt. No, 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 that's not going to happen. No, no, Mandy will simply carve a false tooth from this walrus dust. Thank you, Mandy. Right away, <laughs> Mr. Georgians. Well, that sounds all right. Right. Lie on the floor for me, please. What floor? So I can clamp your head between my legs and uh, rip out the tooth. Hey, oh. Oh, this strange. Hmm. Is this something you said? Did you know George Washington, the first president of America, had dentures made from hippo and elephant ivory? Ah, hey, they must have been huge! <laughs> what was that? They were carved down? Oh, that's boring. Still, he couldn't have looked any sillier than most posh Georgians with their ever-changing fashions. <laughs>